Welcome back everybody to Tony's Top Tips Workshop um, It's just a, a little quick video of this um, I've had a, 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 some viewers um, ask me what they keep seeing a, a certain machine in the background of the in my workshop and you just see what is it well probably they haven't looked at the other videos because it is on one of my other videos but I'm just going to take you down to the shop and just give you a quick tour of it and then uh, then it can put their minds at rest so I'll see you down there now right, here we are um, what it is is this is a just a little bit of a snippet video um, people um, my viewers when the now and again they keep catching sight of a uh, um, obviously they've not seen or uh, watched some of my other videos but they're asking me what's that small CNC or machine that we see sometimes in the background well this is a machine it's called a tool tech um, that's the make that it came from but um, I believe um, there are a lot of uh, similar ones from uh, Bravo Prodigies is a software that it uses the company that does it from China and I've had this a while and as you can see from the the bed there um, it actually has done quite a lot of work as this it's um it's it, on my videos that I've done on the machine uh, if you look back it's um I converted the spindle which is here to ER11 collet than just taking a standard size collet um, standard size um, cutter so it'll take anything now it is like a stepper motor um, spindle here it's brushless um, it's not a, a large one um, I think it's somewhere in the region about 150 watts something like that but it's more than capable is this machine now uh, last is it it looks small it's a 30 30 same as what Saint Smart's just brought out similar to that size and this table here moves backwards and forwards um, the actual uh, gantry stays where it is the x-axis stays where it is so the only the the motor moves from left to right and the table moves from front to back um, pretty simple really but what I must say with this machine is I have great difficulty picking that machine up this is all cast aluminium cast aluminium this thing is extremely heavy I didn't realize when I purchased it um, I purchased it for then which i've had it a few years now about 900 pound these things if you see them on the internet they're in region of about oh i think 1800 something like they're not a cheap machine at all the accuracy is pretty good um i have me me monitor above it because me i have a me k40 as a separate pc touchscreen PC that I use for that and this operates this only um, the keyboard comes out from underneath and it has a like a handheld controller but you run it from your PC it's just to move it up and down and, and what have you there's no touch off probe with it um, you do it with, with a nice bit of paper like you used to do um, and it's it's quite accurate they slide out um, but yeah, uh, as I say, um, the the actual companies that make these now, um, I think ones, I think ones trend. They do it similar machine. You can get different versions of this on the internet as well. But people have said, oh, it looks a bit. Is it plastic? No, <laughs> trust me, uh, it's not plastic. It's very very well constructed. Um, you know it's and it and it it's safe it's got a its own isolation down there emergency stop and it stops it instantly um yeah it uh, it's very very good so as i say, only a short little video snippet um it's just for 
questions that are asked that keep people keep seeing it and uh, I'll just remind them so um, I'll just slip that in well, we're back up here now so I just hope that that's put um, a little bit of a uh, bit of a picture on uh, on that machine and then uh, as I say I don't mind people ask if they haven't seen the other videos that's fine if they ask me a question I'll try and sort it out um, and that's solely what this it's only a brief video but that's what it's for so until next time like and subscribe um, and I'll, I'll get back to you if you ask me any questions like I've just done here and, and until next time be safe be careful out there bye for now